Hey guys, this is Joshua from Technip.com and as you all know, memory storage has always been part of our life. There's always documents, photos or files that we need to store on our day-to-day -day basis. Now most of us don't really have the habit of packing up our digital stuff. Mostly we just end up on our smartphone, laptops or even some on a pen drive. It may not be an issue on a short-term period but when the day comes, we are pretty much doomed. Whether you lost or broke your phone or your laptop got striped by thunder, you couldn't be more regret for not packing up those files. From all your hard work to some not so important files, it is all gone now. So the solution to that is to have a cloud storage. A cloud storage is just like an external hard drive but you don't have to worry about losing it. I'm pretty sure everyone is familiar with online cloud service like Google Drive, where most of us store our files on it and share it with our friends and family. But it can be a hassle sometimes when it comes to backing up big files. It takes too long time to get everything up there when your internet data isn't that great. And you can only store up to 15GB of total storage for free or else you will need to pay up to 860 ringgit per month for the extra storage. So what else we can do to solve this issue? The answer to this is to have a cloud storage that works just like an external hard drive. So this is Western Digital My Cloud Home. It is a storage device that plugs directly into your Wi-Fi router and you will be able to access it wirelessly from anywhere you want, just like your smartphone. Setting up the device is actually pretty easy. You just have to connect your My Cloud Home to the back of your Wi-Fi router and then download the My Cloud app on your smartphone and create a new account and let it search for your device. After you found your device, you just have to look for the device code on the back of your My Cloud Home. And all you have to do now is to key in the device code and you're good to go. So there are three main benefits that we get from using the My Cloud Home compared to online cloud service. First of all, the starting retail price for this device is only 800 ringgit for 2 terabyte of storage. You just have to pay once and the storage will always be there. The second benefit will be the backup speed since it functions through your Wi-Fi. You just have to treat it like a normal hard drive and drag and drop your files. It takes only up to a couple minutes to store 10 gigabyte of files, wow. which is pretty quick to me. You can also do the same thing through your smartphone or simply plug in your pen drive or hard drive to the back of the device and it will begin to back up itself. You can also turn on auto backup to help you save some time if you're on a busy schedule like me. Have to deal with all the bossy, the girlfriend thingy, very busy you know. Moving to the third benefit will be the ease of sharing with your friends and family. Say you downloaded a movie or you took some videos or photos on your trip, you can just drop it into your My Cloud Home and generate a shareable link and send it to the ones you care. Like your papa, your mama, your koko and DJ. You know, the typical families. Because it doesn't require you to download the file and you can stream it directly to multiple device. Even if you're far away from home, you can also access the My Cloud Home using internet data. And if your main concern is about privacy, like you want to use the storage to store your personal files, like your private photos with your girlfriend or private video with your boyfriend, I don't know, just something private. Well, in this case, you don't have to be worried because each user will get their own storage space. So that's it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you want to know more about the Western Digital My Cloud Home device, make sure to find the link somewhere in the description box. And what else I can say? Have a great day and stay awesome and stay with us on technif.com for more tech news. And thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye!